Hi, welcome to Expat Hydroponics. In this episode, we will plant a tray of seeds to show you how to get the best germination results. Okay, so we're gonna start, uh, here's the seed process or how we plant seeds. And this is Reme, so go ahead Reme, what are we planting today? Uh, we have some red lettuce, pet chai. Pet chai? And the other one is wansoi. Wansoi, which is cilantro, right? Yeah. Okay, so go ahead. So this, how long did you boil the cocoa feet? Uh, more than 10 minutes or 10 minutes, something like that. Okay, 20 minutes. All right, so at least 10 minutes. Yeah, at least 10 minutes. You need to fill it up first. And so this is not normally where we, we do the seeds um, because it gets a little hot here during the day. Yeah. Uh, the intention building this table was to do it here, but it's uh, it's just this, when the sun beats down in the greenhouse, it gets too hot in here, so. But there's not enough light where we normally do it, so that's why we're here. Okay, so this, how many how many holes in this tray? Uh, we have 105 uh, holes. 105 so so we're planting 30 pachai 21 soy and 55 red lettuce okay so the soil is uh Oh, it's a little wet, so that's good. Yeah. It probably helps with the uh, germination. Huh? Yeah, let's see. So using the cocoa peat, uh, we get much better germination, right? Yeah. Than the soil. Yeah, the soil, we're getting 60 to 70%. Yeah. And yeah, cocoa peat, enough. it's uh, almost like 100% now. Yeah, so in a couple of trays, right? Okay, so you add all this kind of loose. Yeah. I think that's enough. Okay. Then I'm going to pull some holes in there. Okay. I'll probably I'll probably speed up the video here. So that that is uh, yeah, okay. So that's the one soy, which is only twenty, right? Okay. Is this the first time we've grown one soy in the uh, yeah, hydroponics? Yeah, I think so too. But I remember I already planted it. You planted this in our garden? Yeah. Okay. So that's our 20. Yeah. And that'll go back in the the one soy bag so we know what it is. Today's the 15th, right? Okay, good. Okay. Now will you put soil on top of that too? No. Uh, we're just gonna going to cover them. Just cover a little bit, okay. Yeah, so 
So whatever you've been doing, it's been working, so. I'm not going to argue with success. So I'm going to speed up the video here a little bit. Uh, the cilantro seeds are, are a little bit large. They're not as large as the pelleted seeds, but we're able to get one per uh, square. Uh, the uh, the next is the pachai or what what we call in the U.S. bok choy. Those are kind of small, so uh, we may get two or three seeds per square, and and that's okay. We'll be able to cull those out and get what we want. Also, the lettuce seeds are are small as well. This is something that we didn't do last season that yeah. is going to help us out a lot, especially in scheduling. Okay, and go ahead, and that's going to go it's going to go underneath there, right? Spray some water. Oh, you got to put some water first. Okay. Okay. So just lightly, so it doesn't dislodge the seeds. Soak it real good. Well, the good thing is it was already wet from boiling, so. Yeah. Okay. Let me get the door for you. And this goes underneath. Okay, great. So after germination, we put the seeds here where they're under lights 24-7. Then after one week, we then transfer them into the cups and then into our NFT system.